and we are on air. Hi guys, my name's Brianna, and today's Thanksgiving, so I thought we'd talk about everything I'm thankful for this year. So let's get right into the video. So first of all, happy Thanksgiving, everybody. And second of all, I have done this video for quite a few years now, but I didn't do it last year, so I'm sorry about that. But I like to make a habit of just talking about what I'm thankful for every year for Thanksgiving, because sometimes it's hard to keep in mind everything you're grateful for, and then when and life seems a little bit more difficult, you forget, and you need that little reminder. So that's what we're doing today. Now, normally I start this video with a preface that, of course, I'm grateful for the more obvious things like food and water and shelter, and I kind of brush past it into more specific things for me. But this year, I want to elaborate on some of those basics just a little bit more than I usually would. First of all, am I grateful for the roof over my head? Absolutely. But second of all, I haven't done a video of what I'm thankful for since I moved into my apartment. Even though it's been over a year and a half now, I just would like to say that I am so grateful to not only have a roof over my head, but have a roof over my head that I worked hard to get and that I work hard to keep and maintain. And I'm just so grateful that I'm able to be at a stage in my life where this is a possibility. And kind of going along with like food and water and that kind of thing too, I I am really lucky to not have to depend on anyone for those kinds of things anymore and to be able to provide it all for myself, but also I'm incredibly lucky that I don't always have to provide all those things for myself. My parents send me with food home all the time, my boyfriend buys me food all the time, and like I'm just so lucky that I have the ability to provide all the basics for myself, but I'm lucky enough to not always have to and to have support from so many people. Then the next thing that I am thinking thankful for would of course be Dusty. She's my baby and I've had her for quite a few years now and she will always be the biggest love of my heart. She was the first pet I ever had that was 100% mine and she's shown me a love that I will never find anywhere else and I'm so so lucky for her and I'm also so grateful for Neji who is the newest of my little family. Him and Dusty aren't the best of friends yet but they get along a little bit and we're working on building that relationship and he has shown me a new kind of love too and I just love animals so much and now I have a cat and a lizard and it's just so fun and the different personalities I get from both of them and the different types of love I get from both of them and I just couldn't be more grateful to get to live on my own but never feel alone because I have animals here who love me just as much as I love them. Next I just want to say that I am so grateful that I have access to healthcare like therapy. I know that for a while I had a hard time figuring out a way to go to therapy and once I figured it out things have been improving so much when it comes to my mental health and I know not everyone has access to therapy which is awful. Everyone should have access to it but since I'm one of the people who does have access to it I just want to express how grateful I am that that's a possibility and I wish it was a possibility for everyone. I also want to reiterate how thankful I am for all the support I've had from my family. I talked about it a little bit earlier in terms of food and stuff like that, but just also in general in terms of my life and where I'm going and things I've been doing. They have just been super supportive lately and I couldn't be more grateful for that. And going along with support, I am so so grateful for my boyfriend Joey and all the support and love that he gives me. He's my breath of fresh air at the end of the day when I can just sit and relax with him and just talk and chill and watch a TV show together. There's no greater comfort to me than him and I'm so grateful for him. Another thing I'm grateful for is actually all the people I've lost in my life. I know that seems a little weird to be grateful for, but I'm grateful that I've weeded out all the people who don't truly care about me and weeded out all the drama and I just, I don't need to deal with it anymore. I don't 
don't need people in my life who aren't serious about our connection, whether that is as just friends who go out to have fun or close friends. The depth of the connection isn't really what I'm questioning. I'm questioning people who don't really care that we have a connection, period. I'm just grateful to have weeded all of those people out, and then that has led me to being incredibly grateful for the friendships that I do have right now. I don't have many friends, but the friends I do have, I know will be by my side no matter what happens and will always be there to support me, just like I'm always there to support them. And I couldn't be more grateful for those relationships that I'm building and strengthening over time. And I'm just really beyond words grateful. Another thing I've been incredibly grateful for lately is music. And I always say how grateful I am for music because music will always be the one place I feel the most seen and heard and feel like I'm in a community. But I just really want to emphasize it again. I am grateful for all different kinds of music that can put me in all different kinds of moods or help me feel seen in the things that I experience and feel. Music just truly has the capacity to do anything and be anything. And whether it's listening to music, writing music, playing music, singing music, music is everything to me and I'm so grateful it even exists. And I'm so grateful for every musician out there adding to the large amount of music that is there for me when I need it. There are so many more things that I'm grateful for, so I could go on and on and on, but I will end off with simple, I am thankful for all of you guys. If this is your first time watching one of my videos, your 100th time, if you're subscribed or not subscribed, any amount of support you've ever given me in this journey, I am thankful for you. I've been making YouTube videos for many, many years now, and it wouldn't be the same without all of you guys watching and this community that we're building together, and I just want to thank you guys, and I hope that you know how grateful I am, even if I don't always talk about it. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. But for now, that's it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Happy vet in, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Mwah.